Hey everybody, uh, I am currently doing the Disney College program, so if you're new here, go ahead, hit that subscribe button, and if you like videos just like these, then hit that like button too. Today is my arrival day. This is my day where I go to fill out all of my paperwork. I know I look kind of crazy, we're gonna fix that. But yeah, I'm so, so, so excited, but really I'm just very nervous. I'm trying not to think about it. I don't know why. I think I'm not the only one. I just get so nervous when I'm starting someplace new. I don't know, it's like the first day jitters. It's not even, I'm just doing paperwork. I will probably only be uh, there for like an hour, but I'm just, ugh, I'm so scared. I am going to be getting ready because <laughs> I look crazy. I will be getting ready and if you guys want to keep up to date on things like more up to date follow me on instagram or follow me on tiktok i'm gonna try to post more on tiktok but i definitely always keep you guys updated on my stories so follow me there um but yeah ah okay let's do this i want to show you guys my eeyore shirt because i think it's really cute um it used to be my mom's shirt but now it's mine so obviously it's another day i did do my arrival at disney but because I live off site, the whole process was super, super fast. And because of that, I wanna show you guys the things that I got of uh, me getting ready more on my phone because yesterday was just like super, super fast. That's all I had time for. So I'll show you guys a quick little phone cam a view of me getting ready for yesterday. And then we can talk about what happened afterwards. I leave to go do some paperwork for Disney in about an hour or so. Help me get ready because I'm so stressed and I'm so nervous and excited. I won't have a mirror, so you guys are gonna be my mirror. I am not doing much for makeup. I've got like weird bangs going on. That's because my hair is permed. It's not naturally like this. So the perm is growing out. So like, I turn to the side, you can see how much it's like grown out. This is terrifying because I don't have a mirror. I'm so scared to do this. I fixed the hair as much as I could. The reason I'm weird about my bangs is that sometimes I feel like if my bangs are straight and my hair is like super curly, I feel like, you know, Pam Beasley from like season one, season two, her hair was like flat and then like really curly. But this is the look for getting my picture taken and doing some paperwork. Oh, stay tuned. So because I do live off site, all I had to do was my onboarding paperwork and that was super easy. All you had to do was just go to Flamingo Crossing and do my paperwork there. And um, I decided to get a little bit nicer looking. They also took my photo. So that was super easy. Everybody was super nice. I had like a million questions and they answered all of them. So that was really great too. If you didn't know, there's like nice little visitor parking, uh, which I didn't know about. My friend told me about it. So I was like super happy that she told me about that because I would have had no idea where to go. I was also kind of expecting there to be like different signage at different places, kind of like a college orientation or like a college move-in, you know, when they have signs up, at least at my college they did, they had like signs everywhere and they had like people like right there to tell you where to go. But like for this, there was nobody to tell me other than like finally getting to a front desk of the building. So I had to kind of figure it all out on my own, which was fine. It wasn't anything like too challenging, but it was just different. I thought that there'd be more people there to like direct me. But yeah, it was basically, I just did paperwork and other housekeeping things, super easy stuff. I was like beyond nervous, which I didn't need to be because it was like really, really easy. And I was in and out of there like 30 minutes, like tops. Uh, and that was just because there was confusion on my part. So it was really easy. They did give me a cute little lanyard and a magnet and I will show you guys that. I have to find it. But it's this cute little magnet of like your name, like a name tag, like so I can write my name on it, which I think is really cute. And I don't totally remember what I was saying. My camera cut me off because I don't have enough storage, so. Uh, I think I was talking about how it says like 40 years here, um, which is really cool because I'm doing the Disney College program during their 40th year celebration of having the Disney College program. And I think that that's so cool and so super, super special. And I feel very lucky and very blessed to be a part of that. And um, yeah, it was, it, 
not only that but also it's like the 50th anniversary of Walt Disney World so like that's super cool too and I just I don't know I feel really lucky and I'm very thankful to be able to be right where I am but it was really interesting I ended up I was like talking to one of the people who was helping me at the very end and he kept telling me he's like you know you should feel like super lucky to be a part of this and I was like yeah yeah like I, I really do I feel so lucky and, and he just like kept emphasizing on it and I was like dude like you have no idea how much this means to me and I didn't know how to like tell him like this has been my life's dream you know but um, honestly this has been incredible and it's only the beginning um, so I don't know I'm just I feel really really lucky and super blessed to be a part of this program and to be able to make magic for guests so that was everything that I did for the arrival day like I said it was just housekeeping things like super easy nothing too scary um, but I do have traditions at the end of this week where they're calling it it's traditions like it's just my orientation basically uh, so it will be like the full day so I'm excited to take you guys along on that hopefully things won't be as quick and I'll be able to take you guys along on more stuff um, and maybe show you guys around Flamingo Crossings a little bit because I haven't had the time to explore there yet or at least I didn't have the time to explore there when I was there um, so I'm hoping during the day of my orientation that like I think I have like a long time off for lunch so I'm hoping I can walk around and kind of I don't know look at it because it's pretty cool and I want to take you guys along on that too but uh yeah that's what I have for now and I will talk to you guys in another one bye